welcome to the channel. Today I'm showing you a AI project management assistant. It uses either Outlook or Gmail for its emails and calendar. It also runs a fully self-hostable base row database for all of the project management functions and contact functions. So here it is, you've got your calendar and email agents there and then you've got your projects and tasks and contact agent. Here's the database that makes it all happen. You've got all of the projects here linked to the companies that the companies as clients. Then you've got all the tasks for each of those projects assigned to team members. You've got your client contacts here. And then you've got your team member contacts here. So you've got both voice trigger and text trigger from Telegram. Then you've got your main management agent and all of your tools agents just here. In the future, you could build it with MCP protocol because both BaseRow and NAN are natively integrating them in. So let's give it a test. Show me all the tasks that Steve Gray is doing. Who is handling the ad copyright? Can you reassign the ad copyright to Steve Gray? Can you list all of Steve Gray's tasks? There we go, so now the ad copyright has now been assigned to Steve Gray. Can you email Steve Gray letting him know that he now has the ad copyright assigned to him? What makes this all possible is the base row database. If you were trying to handle this with a series of Google Sheets, there's no way of linking between the sheets very easily and it requires a lot more processing by the LLM. Can you show me my meetings for today? Because the base row is a proper database, it reduces the workload on the LLM, making it a lot easier for it to do far more complex things. So, so here's the email that it sent to Steve just here. And that was it confirming the meeting earlier. Let's have a look and see. There, 
there's the add copyright task it's just brought it up and it's just emailed to Steve to let him know and here's the appointments it's in in the calendar I can also add and move the appointments all of this can be self hosted you can swap out the different LLMs and run self hosted ones and if you're running the full software stack that we that we run on our servers then you can even swap out the, the part of the workflow that handles the processing of the of the voice and use a locally hosted model for that as well links to this model will be down in the description of this video and also links to the workflow will be down in, in the description of the video and will be available to, to buy through Gumroad thank you for watching like share and subscribe and if you'd like any help with any of your AI setup or workflows for your business to make it more efficient then feel free to reach out and we can discuss ways that we can solve problems for your business.